All right, so on a baseball glove, you've basically got two types of knots. On the webs and the thumb and the pinky and the wrist, you've got a square knot. And on the you know, ends of the uh, fingertip run, you've got a, you know, just a regular overhand knot. So I'm gonna show you how I tie a square knot. Um, obviously, it's something that you can practice, get better at, get more efficient, or get a little bit cleaner. Um, this is basically how I do it. So right now, I've got the two rough sides. You're gonna mate those up, uh, cross them over kind of like an X. One of them is gonna go underneath. So I've got the two rough sides out right here, facing each other, and then you kind of give it a tug. So what you're gonna have is kind of a, uh, you know, like almost like a straight line with a knot in the middle. So from there, you can, you can kind of twist it around a little bit like that, um, but I've found that you can really just kind of keep them in the line that they're in. So you're gonna bring this one up and you're gonna bring this one down. So basically just the opposite. And when you bring this one down and over, you wanna just kind of loop under into that hole right there. So that's the, that's the real foundation, the part that you have to learn to get the square knot correct. So let me show it again. So I'm gonna bring this one up, this one over and kind of through. So from there, you just pull. And as you're pulling, you just kind of straighten it out. So my the knot is actually kind of going this way and then the ends are going that way. All right, so let's see that again on this one. So I got the rough sides, I match those up. I go under with that one. I kind of give it a little twist so get that go that way. So I'm starting here. I'm going to go that way. This one I'm going to go right underneath and I'm going to pull. Nice and simple. Once I get that, I'll take my scissors, trim them to be the same length. how to tie a square knot. There we go.